Okay, it's 512 and hundreds of the best young anglers from around the country will be casting their lines on Lake Hartwell beginning in just about an hour. The 2023 Strike King Bassmaster High School Championship kicks off this morning with teams from across the U.S. and Canada competing. Let's check back in with our Dale Gilbert who joins us live from Green Pond Landing this morning. Good morning, Dale. Well, good morning. It's the High School Bass Fishing Championship Lake Hartwell, it's sponsored by Strike King this year, and this place is packed with students from all around the country and even other countries. Canada, I believe, has some representatives here that are going to be uh, competing for the next couple of days to make it to the final 12. And we've got two local anglers, Luke McGuffin and Caleb Butts from Crescent High School. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Now, y'all are not new to this. How long you been fishing uh, in these kind of tournaments? We've been fishing the competitive middle and high school circuit for six years. Six or years? Seven years, I'm sorry. That's terrific. How, how far around the country have you traveled? Um, we've been as far north as uh, Wisconsin. We've been to Texas. We've been to Alabama a couple times, Tennessee, Kentucky. If That was basically like most people go on a family vacation. We went on a summer fishing trip somewhere. 481 teams are showing up this weekend, all trying to get down to narrow it down to the top 12 teams by the end of the weekend. Boy, that's quite a challenge, Caleb. Yes, sir. We're out here on beautiful Lake Hartwell and every point on the lake's got a boat on it. Uh, luckily, we're fortunate enough to live here, so we got plenty of brush piles and cane piles that we put out. You got a few spots. The big challenge is going to be trying to keep the other boats from getting on your spots, right? <laughs> yeah, that's, I mean, you put 481 boats on any body of water, it's going to get challenging. But the thing is here is Lake Hart was known for cane and brush piles. It's summertime. People are going to be out there using their electronics, finding brush, finding fish. And it's just, you've got, for us, we've got some things that are a little bit off the path of where you'd normally find it. So that kind of helps us out having some local knowledge. But at the same point in time, everybody's got the same electronics out here. But with 481 people, there's some stuff that somebody had to run over and find. So it's just going to be the name of the game. We call it musical chairs. Somebody's going to get up and leave. Somebody's going to go. It's just you got to make the right rotation at the right time. Well, you all have had good success here representing Crescent High School. Caleb and Luke, thank you so much for taking a few minutes. Yes. Good luck out on the lake today. Your best three fish, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. Well, we hope they're all big ones. From Lake Hardwolf at beautiful Green Pond Landing, I'm Dale Gilbert. Now let's go back to Perella for an update on the weather. Right. Thank you so much, Dale. Hey, by the way, we've all taken a vote here, and we think you have the best Channel 4 hat on the planet. Looks very nice. Hey, let's take you back out to the Bassmaster High School Championship. It's going to feel like about 100 degrees, calm southwest winds, but mostly dry to get out there and catch those fish today. We'll take a look at your entire forecast, including the weekend, next.